Okay. Welcome back. So, Online Armor has finished the learning process here. So, what I've got here is I have... Okay, there we go. A trial expires in 24 days. Phew, that makes more sense. So, I'm just going to go into, into advanced mode. Um, it doesn't really matter. Program version, you can check for updates. Last update, it says it's downloading update list. So it's probably updating the antivirus engine right now and the antivirus uh, detection files, the signature files. So it's just giving me little pop-ups here and there of what is ingoing and what is outgoing. You can turn it off so it doesn't tell you any of the alerts or anything like that. So I'm going to take a look at my task manager here while I'm waiting. And see what kind of memory this is using. So these are the files right here of online armor. I'm seeing a 1000k, 1000k, 8000k, 8000k, 3, no. So it is using roughly, I guess, 20,000k, which is not bad for a, a suite as complete as this. Um, yeah, so that's pretty good. So, it does have a lot to update here. Um, I'm just going to go through the settings while it's updating. So, you can change with the host. You can edit websites that you want to tr trust or not trust. You have your firewall page that will show you firewall rules. This is shows up in advanced settings where you can configure blacklists, restrictions, rules. Um, this is the interesting part of this suite that I'm going to hopefully be mainly checking today. So, I definitely want to enable heuristic detection. That is an absolute must for me. Maximum scan file size. I'm going to say that 100 megabytes is perfectly fine because malware is usually like 500 kilobytes to 5 megabytes maximum. So, and that's more of the scan settings. But there really isn't much to do here. It's pretty simple. Uh, straightforward interface with not many settings to change. So, it's just updating its files, it seems, right now. And unfortunately, I'm thinking it's going to ask me to reboot again just by the files it's updating. So now it's checking for new virus signatures. Now it's going to download those. You know what, this is pretty boring. I'm going to pause the video until it's finished updating. And I'll be right back. Here we go. Um, I'm really keeping my fingers crossed that this virtual machine doesn't crash, because it really was, and it wasn't working, and changed some settings, and seems to be working now. But I had to reboot for the updates, and it had to go through learning mode again anyway, so it was good that I paused the video. I'm going to get my links going now. I have 13 of them. Um, and we're going to see how this all works out. I'm really excited to see how this goes.
So a lot of these are Trojans. I felt like a lot of rogues tonight, so there are a ton of rogues mixed in here too. I know this link worked earlier. Um. Hang on, let me pause the video again. I'm not sure what's going on with this internet connection of mine. Sorry about that. My online armor actually on the host computer, even though I turned off all the firewalls and everything, was kind of messing with the connection. Um, even though it was connected, it wasn't letting connections through. So, I'm going to start having fun. I don't have much time for any fun like this anymore, so I'm going to have to do three parts of the video. So, Infected program wants to run. You don't get much better than that. Um, I'm going to delete the file. I don't see any reason why I shouldn't delete the file, personally, because I know it's bad and I don't want it to run. It can't find the file path. That's pretty good. Actually, there's one thing I do want to do just to actually put this to the full test of what it's got, I'm just going to um, run Internet Explorer. As I'm going to run I explore as safer. That way, Internet Explorer is now a much safer browser than it used to be. Even though I'm using IE6, it's still much safer than it used to be. I have only time for like two more links now before I do have to do another video part. Let's see what I can get done. That's a broken link. Okay, this does not look um, malicious to me. So that was a broken link. I have to continue in the next video part, believe it or not. That was... I'm taking up a lot of time here. So, I'll be back in part three.